Hello, good people of YouTube. Mountbatten here. And today, as you guys know, uh, Masa is being removed from its spot, as I mentioned yesterday, uh, and is being replaced with, I believe, the Poltava. But if you do manage to get Masa before it is gone, you will get a free tier 10 premium or a reward ship, whatever you want to call it. They're pretty much the same thing. Um, and the Masa is going to go to the Armory. I think it's going to be available for Cole as a tier 10 premium cruiser. So... You have, I believe, when this video goes up, 10 more days to do that. Now, I have been busy grinding through the Chappie. Uh, for those of you that don't know, a while ago I grinded up to the Shores and the uh, Russian Cruiser line, and then I kind of put it on the back burner. But when I heard that Masa was going bye-bye, and if you get her, you will get a Tier 10 Premium, well, like many of you, I'm now grinding Masa, and I just got to the Dawn School. I just finished the Chappie. Surprising little boat. I actually enjoyed it. I thought I wasn't going to at first, but once I got the hang of it, wow, it was pretty good. So now I'm at the Dawn School, which I believe this is the point where the Soviet cruisers start becoming less like the uh, Dawn School and Cha uh, the Dawn School, like the Chappie, and more like a uh, Stalingrad Junior kind of sort of. So. I have my camouflage and all my special signal flags put up on the Donskoy right now, but I haven't put my modules in there just yet. So let's take a look at the armor. Oh yes, very Soviet armor. You guys got that strip that goes up there, the little cheeky pad. Okay. And well, why is my game being so laggy right now? That's uh, impressive. It's being very laggy. Hmm. I guess it's because the Fjords port is just so re uh, demanding. So let's look at the modules. I'm going to go with pretty much the same thing I have on Dawn Score, and then I will adjust as need be. So main armaments mod 1. And let's go with engine room protection. And I guess we can go with aiming systems mod yeah just this is what I normally do on cruisers um and then I'll go back and change it as need be um then let's go with aiming propulsion mod one for the jukes um concealment because being able to disengage is fun and yeah main battery mod three more dpm so um I moved my um, Chappie commander, commander over and he had his 12th skill point and I'm with IFHE because now I will be facing most well it's ent mostly entirely tier 9 tier 10 ships and having 30 millimeters of pin and eh, that may not be that great so I have 37 millimeters of pin and with the signal flags I managed to get my chance of starting a fire back up to 7.5 percent it was at 13 percent so we'll see how this works so Let's go ahead and watch my reload now. 11 seconds. That's pretty nice. All right, let's go ahead and jump into battle. And as always, if you guys have any suggestions for me, please let me know in the comments down below. Below, as far as my captain build and my module build, because uh, like I said, I really don't know cruisers all that well. I mean, I do have several tier, tier 10 cruisers, but you know, I haven't played them near as much as I have battleships. But it's been going pretty well with the Chappie, so I think I'll be alright, but we shall see. <laughs> An actual fire. Oh, yeah, and when I set a fire, you know, I can actually get some damage off of uh, the jump bar just removes the Hindenburg from the game. Everyone's hiding behind island except for the Monarch. Thank you, Monarch, so I may farm damage off of you. And he beached himself. Oh, wow. Okay, uh, yeah. Definitely stole that. Look at Chappie. Uh-huh, now he's going to continue to go in reverse. 
snark thing. No one expects the reversing. Thank you, Mountain, for eating my shells. No one expects the reversing cruiser to continue to go into reverse. There we go. The jukes. Ooh, this should be a good hit. Yeah, it was. He figured this thing has four turrets, and I don't know why. Another fire. I'm not gonna lie, I'm kinda doing better than I do in small Linsk in terms of fires. And, and and keep in mind I've only set three and I've got eighty six hit eighty six hits so far. In small Linsk it, it for some reason takes me like a hundred shells to start one fire. Oh my god, we won already? What the heck? I was just getting into the groove too. Fifty six out that's not bad, and I would have done more if the game lasted longer. Oh my god. Wow. Okay, well, let's keep going. That's kind of sad. That game only la lasted like eight minutes. Excuse me, Jean Bart. I'm trying to get in radar range of wherever that destroyer is at. Okay, Montana, just don't look over here and we'll be okay. Ah. There it is. I really should have waited for my turrets to rotate around. He beached himself. Look at this Fletcher go. Mad lad. Alright, go find the Ostergotland now, Fletcher. Oh, look, that's a nice find. Naturally, I set the fire on the carrier where it's going to burn for two seconds. Now I'm just bouncing everything. That's at max range. I need to get closer. Mm. 
I think I know how Addison feels when he stumbles across a bunch of uh, ships to farm. Just lost our first ship, which was in Alaska. He's dead. Neptune just got mag deaded. Set a fire, yay! Things that perma fire too, because that FDG has been getting welled on by most of my team. These are some amazingly interesting teams. I said another fire on the FDG. Wow. I nabbed that kill. I sure did. Uh, he's dying soon. Again, game finished before I could get much done. Good god. Yeah, I think I got, what, 40? 40? Yeah, 41. Again, not bad for me in a cruiser, but I mean, look at that. <laughs> um, again, just the game ending before I could get too much damage in. Jeez. Detected, I'm pretty sure it's the Kitakazu. Uh-huh. One set. There you are. engine Shit. Is there you just fired I have like a second well 30 seconds actually Love it when it all hits the uh, torpedo protection. Oh my god. Stop trolling me. Thank you. Probably gonna,
Ah. Okay, I went all out there because I was bored of playing hide behind the island, but that was fun. That was fun. Kind of worked, and I'm pretty sure we're going to win. Hey, we won. And hey, I'm up there, actually. Okay, so we're doing all right. We're doing all right. Oh my god, I'll crunch that. This is legitimately the first time I've seen one in a very long time that I wasn't playing. Even when I play the Kronstadt, I don't run into Kronstadts. Some torpedoes. Ooh, fast boy, Georgia. Georgia doesn't know when to stop. Ooh, there's two Georgias. What a plot twist. Don't escape that easily, Yugamo. Ah, if only my aim was better. Think thin, Donskoy. Oh, there we go. There we go, Friesland got him. Double fire on the Georgia, thank you. What is this Georgia gangbang going on over here? This poor Iowa. Concentrating. Don't look at me, crunch that. Give us South Carolina, uh, North Carolina to deal with. Oh, yeah, that's right. Um, yeah.
this. Ow, that hurt. That hurt a lot. Please, glorious armor. Thank you. No, 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 no. That's why I don't need that main turret. Ah, uh, am I gonna get him? Yes! Yes, I am. Ah. <sighs> That was good. Although we may not win now. <laughs> All right, so um, I'm gonna call it there for the video. Um, I I like it. I do. Um, done around 50, 60 thousand damage in it per game. A um, couple of games felt like it got gypped a little bit because the games just ended so dang fast. I definitely felt like it could have been a easily a hundred thousand damage game, but the teams are just so off balance that. It, I mean, shoot, like that first one, I think we really were only in there for like eight or nine minutes and we won. And yeah, that that, that one could have easily gone into the hundred thousands. But I do like the ship. Um, it's it's fun. It, it is. Uh, it's basically the Chappie with more armor and better torpedoes, although I really didn't get to use them that much. And the times I did use them, I kind of went full on bonsai, although except for the Georgia ones, I was in a bit of a pinch there because, uh, yeah, not much you can do when you're surrounded by two Georgias. Um, but anyway, yeah, I do enjoy the ship. Uh, we're at 31,000 uh, XP, but I do have a bunch of um, signal flags on there, so I'm getting a bunch of free XP, too. So we are, what, 200, 182,000 XP away from the MOSFA, and I've got 10 days left to grind that, so I should have the MOSFA here in a couple more days. But anyway, guys, I uh, hope you enjoyed the video. If you did, please drop a like, leave a comment, and subscribe. Tell me what I'm doing wrong with the Dawn Squad. Give me some pointers on how to play it better. We are on our way to 10,000 subscribers. We, we are getting so close to our halfway point of 9,000, and I cannot thank you guys enough for that. Hope you're having a wonderful Friday. Also, hope you come out to catch the stream tonight right here on the channel at 5 p.m. U.S. Central Time. Again, guys, thanks for watching. Hope you have a wonderful Friday. Hope to catch you guys in the next one. Thank you.